just starting my uh, pico wool off and knitting into the top of my bobble. Now I'm going to cast on oh, eight stitches, numbers up to you. To using knitted cast on and then I'll bind them off again down to one stitch and I'll repeat this five times. So I've got now nine stitches, eight of which I'm going to bind off now knit and bind off using my modified conventional method. There's videos on that elsewhere on my YouTube channel. You both knit the second stitch and bind off the first one in one movement, which makes it looser and faster than regular method bind off. Structurally, it's identical. So there is my, oops, one more. First pico. Now I'll do another four in succession. And then I'll use my tails that are dangling around and still loose to fasten that down properly onto the top of the bobble. The picots form a strip, so I've made five of them. Then I'm going to cut off my yarn and join it back to the beginning, gather them up tightly in the centre, and then sew them onto the bobble. Quick bit of darning, joining the end back to the beginning. And now we have this sort of five-pointed starfishy thing uh, sewn on. And when I was darning the pink tail, I took it up through the middle and made a French knot before I took it back down into the bobble and secured it. So there's one newborn baby size. Lucky number hat. It's called lucky number because any number will work um, on depth of the brim. And, and then you use that number and go up and form the crown of a hat. I experimented on this bobble. Uh, if you make your knit one yarn over, knit one increase through the back of the increase stitch, it slightly closes the gap. So on one side, I did, I did it with a twist in the stitch and it's slightly less holy than when you don't twist that stitch. So another, another possibility also, these bobbles could be double knitting reverse stocking stitch, in which case you would put the far stitch on the needle first and the near stitch second, and then you could just go slip purl, slip purl, slip purl, and it's a very speedy way of making a little tiny tube. 